Well, good morning. Lowell has been talking about it all morning long, the potential for severe weather. We are now in hurricane season, so Scott is here from Home Depot to help us all get ready. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks for having us. You're welcome. I feel like we can't talk about this stuff enough. So it's really hard because really the best thing you can do is prepare. Mm -hmm. You know, Lowell, they've done a great job. We've had 72 hours notice, 24 hours notice that there's going to be pending weather today. If you have a plan and you have it stored and, and ready to go, you can best protect your household, protect your family, and then recover also if something terrible happens. So we'll get started with, you've got a bucket. Why the bucket? Well, buckets are great for everything. From catching water, if mm -hmm. you have a leaking roof, you can store your materials in there. You, you can never not have a home depot. Tarp bucket. to protect. Yep, so tarps, if you have a roof that gets damaged, mm -hmm. you, can, you can lash down the, the roof. Or if you have like patio furniture, you can zip tie your patio furniture together so oh, it yeah. has more weight mm -hmm. and then you can you can tarp it down, things right. like that. Batteries, 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 and in every shape and size. And here's the crazy thing, batteries, the great thing about them is if they're in their packaging, they're still good. So you can leave batteries for 10 years and then you have them when you need them. Yeah, and this is the way to buy those double A's too, yes. in bulk like 100%. that. All right, um, that's not duct tape, it's hurricane tape. So uh, duct tape is obviously great. Mm -hmm. There's Hurricane tape is a woven tape, right? and then you have Gorilla Tape, which is also a very strong tape. So if you have to hold things together, repair things, it's just the great way to do it. Okay, Bun uh, electrical cords. Obviously, we have the generator mm -hmm. there on the floor. Generators are really important. You need to keep them far away from the house. Too many times we hear in the news of people dying from carbon monoxide. So the, having a long extension cord, the right thickness, so it can power up your refrigerator, your necessities. Let's talk about that generator that you brought this morning because Lowell was taking an active interest in looking at that. Um, it's just, it's not too big, but it's small enough to power a few things in your home. Right, so you look at the wattage of what you're mm -hmm. requesting. So if you have a refrigerator, if you have a couple of lights in the house, if you need something portable and quick, that has roller skate wheels on it. It has USB ports on to charge a phone so you can keep in contact with loved ones. Oh, that's fantastic. So, yeah. Okay, trash bags and this lantern here. You've got these all over the store. So obviously years ago we used kerosene lanterns. Mm -hmm. Not safe in a household environment. These are fluorescent. They run on batteries. Incredibly long life. And we had different types of lights. This one here is submersible. If it gets in the water, you don't have to worry about it getting ruined. All right, Scott. Thanks. Really good tips. Really appreciate it. No thanks problem. so much.